on behalf of the teachers and the school fraternity. Praise God. Praise God again. Mom, Judy Wameru, Natasha's teacher. A beautiful job, young soul. An angel I have seen grow from grade one. My little best friend, a girl that brought joy and happiness to everyone she came across. The sparkling star that I had in my class. You sat just opposite my table and never wanted to switch just to stay close to me. Being heartbroken is an understatement. As a teacher, I have lost a gem. The chocolates and flowers were a way of showing your love to me. Every time your classmates would plan a surprise, you couldn't hold it, but just respond to me with the excitement that they are planning something for me. Your love was beyond measure. She was always complimenting everyone she came across, and this would uplift our spirits as the SPA fraternity. Her intelligence was way beyond her age, and that amazed us. She had solutions in every situation that arose in the class. Natasha loved this and always stood up for the school. Your generosity, a conspicuous trait that your classmates emulated. You enjoyed greeting every staff, thus making you a favorite student to all. My sweet girl, it will tear when you believe that you will no longer have you leading devotion. Every smart and conscious of your parents and loved her beauty and long hair. We had best for processions, indeed, memories are best kept in photographs. When you are in India, we will do your call on Saturdays and send greetings to your classmates and assure that that all is well and that you will be back to school. We pray for your healing and had high hopes after a successful transplant and eventually God will do in his own way. We are no longer in pain. It is well, my girl. Paradise has been a lovely angel. I shall cherish the memories your sincere love, heart, and ever smiling face. It is well, it is well. Fly high, our ever shining star, Natasha. Thank you very much, uh, Jude. Now, who you are, Ambaya Na Soma, Anaito Christine Kangai, the big sister, wa Natasha kwa sababu wa Mekana Natasha, hapo nyumbani zaidi ya miaka kumi. And then that is tremendous, tremendous love. You can proceed, Christine. Praise God. Mama, your, your dentist has really affected me. The many visits to the hospital kept my offside. The many promises you made to me are now memories. You promised never to give up, even when things caught up. When I got the news that you've gone to be with your maker, I could not sleep. I wish I was in a I thought you had just taken a long nap and you would, you would wake, wake up soon. It's not that I know that you are gone forever. Since you are done, nothing feels the same again. When I meet our friend, Especially Sunday school kids asking me how you are doing. It breaks my heart knowing that you are no more. If love and tears could bring you back, you would be here with us. But only God knows why you've gone to soul, Tasha. Dear Miss, a forever love, Mama. If granted another chance to take care of you, I'll do it again and again and again. Let's eat till we meet again. Tasha, my girl, my friend, my small sister. So I'll be reading the tributes.
to our dear sister on behalf of our brothers, me, Jay, and Christian over there. Our beloved sister Natasha, how we wish the news of your family in the Mason country. We thank God for the years that you have given us to be. I remember the first time you held me in my arms. I was so excited to be a beautiful family. I remember the first time you went to school. You are so eager to do that one thing I am going to do when you are the first time. I remember when we used to live together, whenever you scored, you went so happy. I miss our family trips during the holidays. We had so many hobbies and one of them was swimming. We also love animals. We would accompany them to the farm and help feed the animals. I miss those sibling arguments like who would get to watch TV first. I remember you will get so angry if I watch football around you. I miss those weekends when we used to play PlayStation together. I tell you, Richard, I will never forget it's on 16th September. That's when the transplant was done. I prayed for the procedure to be a success and indeed God answered my prayers. We will exercise together so that we would be able to become numb from lying in the bed the entire day before they go back to Kenya. You told me that we will hold a hint, will come back, but did I know that our plan will never come for you? The last time we ever talked, you looked so happy. We all loved Natasha, but God loved you more. It will take time to accept what has happened, but I know God has big plans for us. If heaven is for him, then that's where you are going. This is a goodbye for now, even though you are gone, it will forever be in our hearts. Thank you very much. Uh, uh, now, uh, yes, what we get in COVID is doing. You look like you are thinking whether to clap or not. It's in order to clap, even though we are mourning. Now, I want to request that someone brings Mama Natasha uh, to pay her tribute, and I request Patrick Moshiniwa. Baba Natasha, please come along uh, with uh, Joy, your uh, dear wife, uh, so that uh, after she is done, you will also make your children. 